Please welcome. <laughs> I didn't realize that was my cue. <laughs> Power. Hi, Ingrid. Hi, hi. Hello from Austria. Good evening. <laughs> I know. I was just going to say, Ingrid's joining us all the way from Austria. How blessed are we? Good I'm evening. Join you to come to Arizona again. It shall love, like really a lot. And I've been there. And I'm really happy to be back. We're excited to have you there. We're excited to experience you there. Um, but before we talk about all the amazing stuff that you will be doing at Soul Treat, why don't you let everybody know a little bit about Ingrid? Yeah, okay. Um, the focus of my work is spiritual help for self-help. I'm very close to the angels, to Ascended Masters, to Mary Magdalene. And 20 years uh, before I have got the message or the information that I have to channel and spread spiritual tools uh, for supporting if you're working uh, with body work or coaching or healing work. And so I channel spiritual tools and bring them out to the world, also to the US and to Mexico, to Europe, of course, to California, to uh, Australia and um, yeah and I'm also a teacher I'm an author I have written several books and I do live workshops and online workshops how to use this spiritual tools in daily life so that you are uh, not depending on a teacher or um, a therapist you can work for yourself and it's always about self-responsibility and this is what the spiritual world wants to encourage us yeah to get into more mm -hmm. self-responsibility and not to wait if another person could solve your blockage your problems and so on and i think this is a, a important step into the new energy in the energy of the big transformation process we are in and yes to be independent and to be self-responsible is very important I love that, Ingrid. I love it. And I just want to mention, I know that when you mention like spiritual tools and things like that, that people kind of get an idea or maybe have no idea what you're talking about. But what I can tell you, since we're here for a very limited time, what I can tell you, audience members who's who are tuning in, that her tools are even used by physicians in the medical field. So this is not some woo-woo, hocus-pocus stuff that Ingrid has to come up with. They're really amazing tools that actually doctors are using in the medical field. And you're coming all the way from Austria, which I've been to Vienna, right? That's in Austria, right? Okay, yeah. I know my geography. <laughs> and it was absolutely gorgeous. I went there around Easter time. It was amazing. So anyway, I won't take over any more of your time. <laughs> lies, lies. <laughs> Um, yeah, I, I love the work that you're doing and I know, you know, as Anna said, that it, it is well respected and so we're excited that you are going to be um, with us and, and sharing that. Um, so with all of these tools and resources that you bring to the table, um, it's easy for all of us to figure out, you know, what it is that really helps us with our best life. But we've asked you guys to share one of your number one tips and so I'm really intrigued to know what it is that you believe is our number one tip to live, for all of us to live our best life. Um, my tip is to solve and to check um, your problems on four levels. The first level is the physical, the second, the mental, the third, the emotional, but don't forget the fourth, the spiritual level. The spiritual level where you have karmic work, where you have energetic work and Think about, we are, there's the physical uh, world and the metaphysical world, and both worlds are stick together. So we are metaphysical beings living in a physical body. But over a long period of time, we only check the physical level, the mental, the emotional, and we forgot the spiritual level. So don't forget to work together with the spiritual world, with the angels, the ascended masters, with Mary Magdalene and her companions, which I'm very close with, or the Lemurian goddesses, or the saints in a new way, in a modern way. It doesn't have to do with uh, religion, it's spirituality. And for me, spirituality is a house and the religions 
are apartments in the house. So work with the whole house. And you can, of course, uh, live your own religion, but the spirituality is more than one religion. And so um, you can directly connect with the angels and the masters or Mary Magdalene. You don't need another person for this. This is, again, self-responsibility and to be free. You are spiritual beings and uh, you can connect or reconnect by yourself. Sometimes you can use tools, I mentioned before, but you also can do it without tools. But don't forget the fourth level, the spiritual level. This is my advice. I love it. I love it. Ingrid, thank you so much. And I am so excited that you're coming from halfway around the world to come and be with us at Soul Treat and let people experience your amazing um, vibration and your guidance uh, in one-on-one -on -one sessions. So can you tell us a little bit about what you're going to be doing at Soul Treat as a VIP experience provider? Of course. Of course, I will use my spiritual tools, my symbols, because the symbols tell you the story. They tell you the story behind the story. They tell you the story behind the blockage. They, they, they tell you a story behind a problem. Yeah. And if you read or know more about what the symbol wants to tell you, you get more insight. Yeah. We all have blind spots, of course me too but the symbol make like this and they show up and you can say no 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 this has nothing to do with me well, okay i didn't realize but now i understand and this is what i would like to offer to get behind the problems to see behind the story in a very gentle in a very soft in a very uh loving uh kind or art or whatever you mean because it's not to the, oh, oh, this is wrong, but look at this. Do you think about this or is there a resonance? Yeah. And then people can realize that, oh, I didn't see like this. So you can do spiritual coaching. This is what I always do, spiritual coaching with my spiritual tools. And then they get the energy of the angel or the ascended master. And so I'm sure that it will be a very nice experience, not only for me, but of course also your your our guests we can't wait we cannot wait and, and i know you're internationally known and i know that people use your your practices and and your other items i, I don't want to disclose everything i want to keep something secret um but you're you're world renowned so i i just thank you for being part of soul treat and bringing your amazing energy to our um to everyone there and additionally as the one-on-one -on -one service provider for our vip so thank you it's my pleasure to come Thank you for it. You're fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. We'll see you on the Red Rocks. <laughs> yes. Oh, I always do that too early. You do Sorry. that. You do, you do do that a little early. But you know what? I, I love her. I love her and I can't wait to meet her in person, give her a big hug. And it's funny because believe it or not our next guests both know ingrid uh they they've, they met ingrid prior to us even being all together for soul treat which is really amazing and remar remarkable because she really is internationally known yeah. for what she does and you got to come and meet ingrid